What's up, people? Welcome to another installment of Voiceless. What is there to talk about in this another like episode or some shit? Well, basically, like um, we could talk about anything, basically, like how stupid the human race is and how dumb we uh, we tend to be i could go on and on and on about that to be honest but i want to hit on something that really somewhat irritates me and that's relationships relationships are weird they're pointless but they have a point in life Basically, in my opinion, relationships should not, should be like, it should be a hit or miss. Well, I don't know how to explain it, to be honest, but relationships are the weirdest things of all time because you get, because it could be a hit, it could be a miss, it could be a happy thing, it could be a sad thing, it could be cancer, but it could be fucking like helpful. So, I don't understand relationships, to be honest. I love being in a committed relationship with somebody that I love and care about. But, you don't get the same energy back. Which is cancer itself. Because when you don't get the relationship, like, energy that you give out, don't get it back. You wouldn't be short. It's gonna piss you off because you end up to be short without that shit. So I have a love life. But that love life pissed me off. Because it's just like it's pointless right now. You love this person all you want, but you won't get shit back. All you wanna get is Toxicity. You're you're gonna get the toxins and everything with it. So whenever you want to love somebody or just be with somebody, remember you live in a generation where love is fake. Love is cancer. You will not get the same energy back. Because whoever loves you, don't love you. They will claim they love you, but they will do some dumb shit behind your back. They will claim they love you when or after you hurt or after they hurt you. It's sad how the generation is right now when it comes down to love. And I'm stuck in this generation. I just want to kill myself every single day. I breathe this toxicity air. Every time I breathe in this air, I want to die. I want to vent. I want to be one of the people that got dis- that got disarrayed, turned into dust because of the Danos. It's fucking ridiculous. <sighs> but there's the three L's if you don't know what the three L's are. Live, life, lust. No, it's love, lust, and lies. The three L's that is toxic. You got love, pretty gen- pretty generic, strong emotion. You got lust, another strong emotion, but it doesn't re- doesn't relate to love, cause love is a bitch. Lust is what everybody wants. 
it in lies. You could lie about you love somebody, but you want lust. You could lie lie about lust, but you end up being love in love with somebody. Or basically lie to yourself. Either or, you you a fucking dickhead that deserves to be destroyed and obliterated. But that's just me. That's just me. I don't know what else to, what else to like fucking say because it's just bullshit. Because I'm starting to get a little angry and a little irritated by legit talking about this. Because it's like I've been through so much with my life that I just want to end it. I feel as though I got no other way to, no other, no other thing to like do with my life, with myself. Most importantly, because I live in a fucking bull, I live in a fucking bum house. Yeah, I just want to die. <sighs> so, I was gonna make a video about my game. And the progress and shit. But I don't know if I'm gonna have the energy to do so. Because of my condition. Well, I don't want to sound like broken Matt Hardy and shit. But you know, because of right how I feel right now, after talking about this, because I wanted to do something special with, with my channel. So I don't know what to <laughs> else to say <laughs> other than hope you have a blessed day and fuck off. <laughs> I need to talk to people. Jesus Christ this is ridiculous.